Hello Youtubers, I'm Parwaze and this is our 69th video in PyQt5 GUI development and our topic is on QML and QD Click. So in the previous video we have uh, created a text input uh, in QML and uh, this is from the previous video. Uh, in this video uh, I'm going to uh, create a simple example of row and columns. So how you can use uh, row and columns in Qt Quick or QML. So now let's get started. Okay, now uh, I'm going to create a new QML file. So for this, right click file and I call it row.qml. So for the Python, I want to use my the same Python file. Okay. Now the first thing you need, uh, we are going to create import Qt Quick 2.2. Also, we need to import Qt Quick uh, 2.3. Uh, this is dot window. Okay. Now we need to create our window element. So a top level window. And I want to make the visible to true. I want to give it an ID of root. The width 360, the height 360. So this is uh, our window. So if you run this, let me just show you uh, in main.qml. Uh, for I don't want to load my main, I want to load the row.qml. So like this. Now let me run it. Okay, you can see we have a simple window. Now uh, let me create some rectangle in here, and after that I will uh, show you the using on row and columns. So rectangle, and the color is blue. Uh, the width is three sixty divided. Uh, by 3 and the height is 360 divided by 1.2 so uh, let me just run it that I have one rectangle yeah I have one rectangle let me copy this rectangle so for this I want to give it a red and another one is a green so now if I run this we have three rectangle but if I run this mix it green I have a problem in here Miss spelling again, so uh, make sure that uh, you should spell correctly in your QML file. Okay, you can see we have three rectangles, but now they are uh, stacked on the top of each other. Uh, so for this problem in QML, you can use row and columns uh, for this. For example, it's like layout, layout management that you can use, and. Uh, so you can simply uh, write in here you can give a row and uh, you can close this in here like this so now if uh, I run this now you can see how we have uh, uh, three our three rectangles and this is uh, uh, divided according to row uh, also you can do this according to a column uh, for the column and uh, let me just uh, change um, this to column and also we need to change the uh, this width and make this to 3.3 
3D Point 3. Now let me just run it. Now you can see it's according to the column. So like this you can uh, use column and row. Uh, I will add the source code to the video description. If you have any question, please let me know. And also check my blog for more uh, videos. Subscribe to the channel and also uh, please like the video.